Collagen is one of the most popular nutritional supplements flooding the market right now. You'll find dozens of collagen products on grocery store shelves, in health food stores, and online. And all these products boast about their impressive results. But before you invest money on a product that may or may not do what it claims to do, I want to share with you what nobody else is telling you about collagen. Hi, I'm Dr. Brian Paris from the Healthy Back Institute. I've spent over 20 years helping people triumph over their joint pain. In addition to treating patients at my clinic, I also make educational videos like this one, teaching people how to fight back naturally against arthritis and other forms of joint pain. This could be pain in your back, neck, knees, hips, or any of the 360 joints in your body. But I'm here to tell you that no matter your age, no matter how long you've been dealing with your painful joints, you can still take matters into your own hands. So let's get to our subject today, which is collagen. You've probably seen TV commercials for it. It's been the rage for a few years now. Today, I'm gonna reveal some really important facts you need to know before buying a collagen product. Without knowing these facts, there's a really good chance that the collagen you buy will be a total waste of money and won't help you in the ways you think it will. Well, collagen is the most abundant protein you have in your body. It's found in your joint cartilage, tendons, ligaments, bones, muscles, skin, hair, and nails. It actually forms the scaffold that gives your body structure. Basically, you can think of it as the glue that holds your body together. In fact, the word collagen comes from the Greek word glue. There are 28 different types of collagen in the body, and they all do different things. But type one and type three make up about 90% of the collagen you have in your body. When you're young, your body is able to continually repair and replace collagen you need. But here's the bad news. As you grow older, somewhere around the age 25 or so, your body starts to gradually lose its ability to replenish your collagen stores. They decrease by about 1.5% each year, year after year. So by age 60, your body's ability to produce collagen has declined by over 50%. This is why your skin sags and wrinkles. Your hair and nails become brittle and thin. Your bones and muscles weaken. And here's where it gets bad for folks with joint pain. The cartilage in your joints deteriorates. Cartilage is the rubbery tissue that covers the ends of bones to form your joints. Cartilage functions as a shock absorber to cushion your joints so you can move freely without pain. So with a loss of cartilage, you can develop inflammation, joint pain, and a loss of motion and function in your joints. When it gets really bad, you can actually lose so much cartilage that you essentially have bone rubbing on bone. That's extremely painful, as any sufferer will tell you. You've likely run into people who have had joints replaced when it gets this severe. So if you're hitting your 40s, 50s, or later, should you go out and buy some collagen to replace what you've lost? Well, you'd think so, but there's a lot more to it than that. And here's where things get interesting. Collagen is indigestible. We don't eat collagen. We submit collagen to an enzymatic process to derive peptides from the collagen. All collagen comes from animal sources. All peptides come from collagen, and peptides are the product that we're after. So what people are buying isn't containers of collagen, but containers of peptides. Peptides are the chains of amino acids or the molecules that form proteins. They're created by breaking down whole collagen proteins into smaller proteins. You have over 7,000 different peptides in your body and every peptide has a specific role to play. Some peptides stimulate skin recovery. Other peptides stimulate joint recovery. In fact, the most famous peptide in your body is insulin. It plays a vital role in managing your blood sugar. So if your main complaint is arthritis or joint pain, what you need is a specific peptide that stimulates cells called chondrocytes. These are the cells that form the cartilage in your joints. Now, listen closely. Here's what many manufacturers of collagen products don't want you to know. Collagen products are often generic. They take a bunch of different types of collagen peptides, throw them together, and claim that they fix everything. Unfortunately, that's not a targeted effective approach. In other words, you have no idea what you're gonna get. When you're able to get the right collagen to help your poor overworked joints, you're able to ease that joint pain move more freely, enjoy a happier, more active lifestyle. So here are a few questions you should ask and factors to consider before choosing a collagen product for your joint health. First, where does your collagen come from? All collagen is animal-based, so it won't work for vegans or vegetarians. Collagen can come from bovine sources, meaning a cow, 
chicken, eggshell membranes, and marine sources. There are some really crucial things to be aware of. Many products do not reveal where their collagen comes from. They'd rather you not know because it can be from low quality inferior sources. And if you have any potential allergies, such as an allergy to eggs or seafood, you'd wanna know that it could be in a product that you're ingesting, right? Plus, let's just say that collagen from marine sources smells bad. It's not something you'd really enjoy in your cup of coffee, believe me. So many products contain random unfocused peptides. They may also suggest you use two to four times as much of the product per serving than you would need to use if you were taking a targeted product. That's why you only wanna spend money on a high quality collagen product. Which brings me to my second point. Can your collagen product stand up to scientific scrutiny? What I mean is, have any research studies been done to show that it works and truly helps improve your joint function? Let's look at a few examples. One randomized, double-blind, placebo-controlled pilot study was performed at the Tufts Medical Center and examined the long-term effects of specific trademark collagen peptide in individuals with early knee arthritis. Analysis of MRI scan confirmed significant long-term improvement in cartilage tissue regeneration with noticeable changes at 24 weeks. Another small 2017 study confirmed improvement of joint mobility in middle-aged athletes. One last example I'll share with you is a 2017 German study of 160 subjects suffering from knee joint pain. The use of this bioactive collagen peptide led to significant improvement in pain, stiffness, and physical function. Results were even more pronounced after 12 weeks of treatment, and in 40% of subjects, complete pain resolution was achieved. Of course, this is a well-researched, high-quality collagen peptide product specifically developed to regenerate joint cartilage and promote joint health naturally. One other factor I should mention is that I recommend looking for a collagen product that includes the right dose of supplemental vitamin C. This vitamin is critical to the synthesis of collagen and can actually speed up and enhance the healing process, as noted by a 2018 review in Orthopedic Journal of Sports Medicine. I've given you a lot to think about today when it comes to choosing the right collagen product for healthier joints and relief of joint pain. You've seen that taking collagen isn't as simple as going to the store and buying the first product you come across. You'll find more tips and tricks in my next video, along with recommendations for specific products I recommend. So please like and subscribe to my channel. See you again soon.